Estimados estudiantes y padres, me complace compartir con ustedes que comenzamos nuestra nueva inscripción de cursos para el próximo año. A nuestros estudiantes se les presentó una lección detallada de lo siguiente, requisitos de graduación del estado de Maryland, guía de cursos de Springbrook High School, tarjeta de inscripción de cursos de Springbrook, cronogramas importantes. Me alegra que muchos de nuestros estudiantes asistieran a una feria electiva que destacó una variedad de cursos electivos. Pueden encontrar información adicional sobre la inscripción de cursos en el sitio de internet de la escuela. Pueden ir a la página de inicio de Springbrook. Finalmente, padres y estudiantes estén atentos para atender las sesiones después de la escuela. Si tienen preguntas acerca de la inscripción de los cursos, tendremos horarios ex extras para poderles ayudar. Les mantendremos informados. Padres, ustedes tendrán acceso en el portal de la escuela para poder ver los cursos que se han recomendado para los estudiantes. Los padres pueden tener la habilidad de editar, cambiar el curso. Es muy importante que hagan selecciones de cursos sabiamente. Estaremos enviando los cursos seleccionados por correo a finales del mes de marzo y los padres y los estudiantes podrán cambiar o hacer correcciones hasta mediados del mes de abril. Si tienen preguntas, por favor comuníquese con el Departamento de Consejería al número de teléfono 240-740-3750. Gracias. Dear students, parents, and guardians, this is Dr. Williams, the proud principal of Springbrook High School, and I am excited to share that we have started our course registration process for the upcoming school year. Our students were introduced to a detailed lesson that reviewed the following, the Maryland State graduation requirements, Springbrook High School course pathways, and Springbrook registration card also important timelines and due dates. I was pleased that many of our students attended an elective fair recently that highlighted a variety of elective courses. Teachers were on hand to answer questions and share information about specific courses. Additional course registration information can be found on the school's website. Go to the Springbrook homepage, click on the tab that says registration information. Parents, you will be able throughout this process to access the portal to see your child's recommended courses. You will have the ability to edit or to make changes to anything. It is very important that students and parents select courses wisely. Courses that run are based on enrollment. We will mail out the selected courses in late March and students and parents will have the ability to again make changes or corrections by mid-April. After this time, it will be very difficult to make changes because we had already committed staffing and resources to run the courses that were previously selected. So, I am asking all parents and students to review your four-year, three-year, two-year, and one-year school plans that you created in Naviance. Make sure you are registering for the courses that will help you pursue your post-high school options. I encourage you to take the most challenging courses that you can manage so that you will be well prepared for life after high school, whether it's the world of work or college or vocational or technical training. Also, pursue your passion. Find courses that align with your passion, whether it's from music, the arts, sciences, culinary arts, the humanities, or so much more. It is my hope that every student will take at least one AP or IB course before they graduate from Springbrook. If you have questions along the way, we are here to help. In addition to your child's counselor, there are several other people I encourage you to contact. Those that are interested in our child development class, contact our teacher, Ms. Amy Hawkins. If you're interested in culinary arts or hospitality management, contact Ms. Michelle Wright. If you are interested in instrumental or vocal music, contact Mr. Wyman Jones or Ms. Harrison. If you are excited about Justice Law and Society, contact Ms. Jennifer Laskin. If you're interested in our Arts Pathway, 
we are encouraging students to don't forget about the arts. Make room in your schedule to engage in your creativity. Contact Mr. Foster. If you're interested in computer science or our AIT program or Project Lead the Way Engineering, contact Ms. Bolibiak. IB Diploma Program, Ms. Trivers, and our NYP program, Mr. Weinshell, can answer all of your questions. If you're interested in dual enrollment, contact Ms. Teresa Dixon Settles. All of these in individuals' names and contact information could be found on our school's website or just call the main office and ask to be put through to them. Mr. Aldridge is the head of our counseling department and is a great resource. Finally, students and parents, Stay tuned for drop-in sessions after school. If you have a question or you need additional information, we will have extended hours throughout this process, and you can just come in, speak to our counselor, and get assistance. We are here to help. Again, I look forward to partnering with you along the way. Please contact the main office if you need assistance. Thanks for all you do to make Springbrook High School a special place. Welcome. Welcome to Springbrook High School's 2020-2021 Course Registration Phase 1. Overview. Notice the green registration card to the right. You will be using this information to register for your classes for the 2020-2021 school year. Please have your course guide sheet and green registration card available. Schedule change policies and procedures are here for you to review. Please make sure you circle the course number and course and get required signatures from your parent and also yourself on the back of the registration card. Counseling caseloads. Counselors are assigned alphabetically according to student's last name. Notice the counselor name and grade assignment below. Montgomery County Public Schools graduation requirement. Please note what is required for every student to graduate from Montgomery County Public Schools four years of English, four years of math to include algebra, geometry, and two additional math electives, three credits in science to include biology, chemistry, and physics in life sciences, social studies, three credits, U.S. history, national, state, and local government, modern world history, one credit in technology, that is regular technology, in Foundations of Computer Science, Foundations of Technology, AP Computer Science, and Introduction to Engineering and Design. One credit in Physical Education, one credit in Art, a half a credit in Health. In addition, students need to choose option one below in World Language or option two, two credits in Advanced Technology, or option three, a Maryland State Department approved career and technology education program. Additional requirements for graduation include student service learning hours. Students need to complete 75 hours to graduate. Students must pass assessments, state assessments in algebra, English 10, national, state, and local government, and science. Students should be college ready, college and career ready, and here are some tips to help you. Make sure you take rigorous courses. Improve your grade point average. E explore career opportunities through Naviance. Counselors will be conducting presentations to encourage students to take career interest inventories. Prepare by taking the SAT, ACT, or Accuplacer. Earn meaningful student service learning hours. 
Get involved in extracurricular activities and show the colleges that you are a well-rounded student. If you're thinking about college and career readiness, you need to remember that Springbrook will offer over 30 IB and 20 AP courses for the 2019-2020 school year. This is called Challenge by Choice. So please take advantage of all of the benefits of this IB Rural School and challenge yourself by choice. Some other things to remember about the benefits of AP and IB courses are the competitive advantages in college admissions. 85% of selected colleges and universities report that a student's AP experience favorably impacts admission decisions. There are also financial benefits to taking AP and IB courses. Research shows that students who take AP or IB courses are much more likely than their peers to complete a college degree on time. You can also earn college credits by taking AP or IB courses. Students may earn credit or advanced standing at most of the nation's colleges and universities with appropriate scores on AP or IB assessments. This taking of AP and IB courses will also prepare you for college level work. AP and IB courses give students access to rigorous college level work. AP and IB students build confidence and learn the essentials of time management and study skills needed for college and career success. So this year, take an opportunity to challenge yourself by choice as you fill out your registration requirements. When you're planning your schedule for next year, you also want to think about all the programs that Springbrook has to offer. We have the premier college prep program in America called the International Baccalaureate. We also have the Academy of Information Technology. So if you like networking, computer programming, or web design, that's a program for you. But we also have five other programs. If you like hands-on, project-based learning, Project Lead the Way Academy of Engineering could be for you. We also have Justice Law and Society that teaches, that teaches us about the court systems. Early Child Development if you're thinking about being a teacher. Hospitality Management if you want to go into the restaurant business. And we also have New Next Year an Art Intensive Certificate for all of you that like both visual and performing arts. Do you want exposure to a career prior to high school graduation? Do you think your academic studies have prepared you for the real world? Are you ready to explore a work-based learning opportunity using background knowledge? Are you creative and interested in building a current industry professional network that can guide you to college and career? Do you want to experience hands-on practice with business partners yet have strict guidance from the internship coordinator? If so, rising seniors, please consider internship opportunities at Springbrook. So some information before you start scheduling. A master schedule is developed by the number of course selections identified by students during this registration process. School administrators make decisions regarding the number of sections per department based on students' course selections. Under-enrolled courses may not be offered. Students, please take out your green registration card and your white course guide sheet. Carefully review all the courses and select seven classes for next year. Include semester one and semester two. Make sure you circle the course name and the course number. Please note you will see your counselor individually or in small groups in the next few weeks to review your selections and add your request to your MCPS account. If you have any questions or concerns about next year's courses, course offerings, please see your counselor during lunch, before, or after school. After you have selected your seven courses, please submit your green registration form to your English teacher. Please have your parents sign your white copy 
and return to the counseling department by Monday, December 2nd. Please note, if you have more questions, your counselors will be available today, during lunch, or after school if you need assistance. Happy registration!